what's going on? It's Crypto Trap coming at you guys with another video. I'm actually trying to help you guys out as much as possible today. There has been some very high network fees for Bitcoin, and it's kind of scary because you're trying to get your money from one platform to the other. And for a $35 fee to occur is really crazy, but the market is correcting right now, and the fee will go down. But today, I'm bringing you this video to show you guys how you can avoid all those network fees for Ethereum, Litecoin, and Bitcoin as a whole, and Bitcoin Cash, which has been recently added to Coinbase. So there's a website I have that avoids all fees. That $35 fee, that $25 fee that you always see when you're trying to send your money from, let's say you're trying to send your money from Coinbase to BitConnect or Coinbase to um, whatever platform you use to trade, such as Bitrix, Binance, or wherever you're trading from. There's a fee, and with the trick I'm going to teach you guys today, there will be no fee, absolutely zero fee for transferring Bitcoin or Ethereum or Litecoin to any of the platforms. So the site that I'm talking about is GDAX, and if you don't know about that already, it's a, a site that works with um, Coinbase. It's an exchange as well, and they work back and forth together, which means if you have a Coinbase account already, you do not need to create a GDAX account. Once you click sign in, it'll prompt you to log in with your Coinbase account. As you can see right here, it's a Coinbase website. So I'm going to get to the first step of it. I'm going to show you guys in a nice pace so that you guys fully understand what I'm talking about. Yesterday, <laughs> crazy story. I was actually trying to buy Bitcoin and I accidentally purchased some Bitcoin cash twice. And... It just got me crazy. Then I accidentally purchased it with my bank, so I got to wait a few days for the next one to be deposited, and a whole bunch of blah, blah, blah. blah. So with regards to that, I'm going to bring you guys this video today because I corrected my mistakes. And basically what you want to do is normally go to your buy and sell. Once you have your Bitcoin on here, you're going to actually still incur the Coinbase fee and the payment method, which is only about $195, which is what I paid yesterday. So $195 as opposed to a $35 fee that's being cut out, that's perfectly fine. Trust me, because there's going to be fees, and that's a nice little cheap fee that Coinbase uses, and you avoid the Bitcoin network fee. So I bought with my credit card so I can instantly have the money on my account. Basic, right now, you're not able to purchase Bitcoin at this moment of this video because I guess their system is doing a correction, which means it's trying to stabilize, and they're not allowing people to buy in at the moment. But... I would buy 20. Let's say I wanted to buy 200. It's not going to, like I said before, it's trying to stabilize. So if I put 200, it will tell me how much BTC I have here, the amount of um, fees it would be, which mine was actually only 195 when I purchased it, and then the total amount of the total amount that you have that you try to purchase. Once you have that on your account in any of these currencies, you can buy Bitcoin, you can buy Bitcoin Cash, you can buy Ethereum, and you can buy Litecoin. Once you have that on your account, go over to GDAX and just sign in. Once you have a Coinbase account, it goes straight through. It just asks you to log in the normal way you will log into Coinbase. This is your overview for GDAX. Once you're on GDAX, that's when you're going to transfer money for free from your Coinbase account. There's no network fee. You can transfer it free to here. So you would go to your deposit. Once you go to your deposit, you can also purchase Bitcoin from here, but I don't purchase from here because they want to use your bank account, and the bank account, like you can see, takes three to five business days, and ain't nobody got time for that. So with that said, you go to your Coinbase account. There's a Coinbase section for you to deposit funds. You click on your Coinbase wallet. You go, you click on whatever you're trying to transfer, and then you amount, you put in the amount of Bitcoin that you would want to transfer from Coinbase to GDAX. So you could put in any amount that you would like. Then you would deposit funds. It's instant. When I say instant, I mean like two seconds later, I checked my account on GDAX and it took the money from Coinbase for free. Look at this. You got to love this. Coinbase transfers are instant and free at all times. So you cut that whole $35 transaction fee out of the picture it doesn't get better than that so now it's on gdax and any transaction that you do from gdax going out 
It's free. If you have Ethereum, Ethereum, and you transferred it over here and you try to transfer it to another platform, free. If you had Litecoin and you try to transfer it to another platform using the same method, free. It's all free. And if you want to choose between currencies, if you have Ethereum, if you have Litecoin, if you have Bitcoin Cash, you come here and you would do the transfer from BCH to USD or Ethereum to um, USD. And it's the same process I just showed you, but I'm in Bitcoin to I'm in Bitcoin right now to USD. So no matter what you do, you come to this once you stick with your market, the market that you purchase in, and then you go to Coinbase account and then whatever wallet would be here with all your money in, it will show you. Like it will tell you that you have this much in Coinbase. That you put that amount that you want, then it's instantly free to transfer it over here. Now, this is where it gets better. Anywhere that you want to withdraw it to is also free, 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 free. No money necessary to transfer it. So you come here. If you have BitConnect and you want to transfer your money over to BitConnect, you would put your BitConnect address. I don't have any funds, so I can't show you this part. Actually, yes, I could because you wouldn't go to Coinbase account anymore. You go to BCH address. You put the amount of BCH that you would want after you transferred it from Coinbase to GDAX. You would put it into BCH. Then you would put the address of anywhere you want to send that currency to. If it is BitConnect, free. If it is Coinbase, if it's back to Coinbase, it's obviously free. But if it's to Bittrex, free. If it's to Binance, free. You just cut out a large part of the funds that would be spent on fees that you could put into a altcoin or a different cryptocurrency right now. So you just basically came up on your money. So I'm just giving you guys this trick so that you guys know this. Then you will put in your two-factor um, code, and then you will withdraw funds. Once you withdraw the funds, I'll show you guys my orders. It's going to come over, well, my wallet. It's actually going to come over to your account in total. And once it comes over to your account, you're going to see, see the transactions right here. These are transactions I've done. One was for BCC because I accidentally did that, and then one was for Bitcoin. And it instantly comes here. It's going to come. It's going to pen for a little bit so it can get confirmations from miners. And then it's going to deposit to your account. And you guys can see I racked up on Doge. And I'm getting into Ripple as well. And they're fluctuating, so this will go up and down. But I'm going to do long-term holds so that the profit rises, increases, increases. And everything goes out how it's supposed to. If you want to add from... Um, GDAX to Bitcoin, you would come to Bitrix, you would come over, you would search in Bitcoin. This is where I used to trade my altcoins, by the way, Bitrix, if you guys don't know. I have a previous video on how to do this, so check that out. You would add, they give you your address. This is where you're going to be sending it to. You put your address in here. Your address loads up, you put the amount you want, free transaction goes straight through quick and easy. And then you have your money here ready to trade. And that's actually a very big positive because we don't have time for the fees. Some people are not in their situation to incur those. And the market is just a little bit wild at the moment. So it needs to be tamed. And once it's tamed, the fees will go down. But this is just a, life, a lifelong lesson on how you can avoid those fees in total. And you guys, I'm trying to give you guys as much positive content as possible, and I would appreciate if you guys subscribe, like, and comment on anything you guys want to see. If you guys want me to do videos showing you certain things that I'm not discussing, let me know. And I would like, if you guys want to get free Bitcoin, I have a video on how to get free Bitcoin. If you guys want to know how to get into BitConnect and actually invest in your money, as I am right now and gaining daily interest, which is beautiful. You guys go check that video out. If you guys don't even know how to get on Coinbase, I have a video showing you demonstrating exactly how you can get a Coinbase account and add your card and invest in your first Bitcoin. And I'm going to be giving you guys a lot more videos because I would love to build a community where people can talk, chat, and beginners can come and just learn as much as possible because investing is one of those things in your life that can bring you the long way as opposed to short-term careers. If you know how to invest, you will make it much further than if you just know how to 
flip a burger. So invest in yourself. If this helps, give this a like, give it a subscribe, and let me know. So Crypto Trav out.